Hi, this is Kwang Hyun Jung at KPF Korea. Uh, today, I'm going to show you how to use TC bolts and how accurately KPF TC bolts work. Normally, on the job site, skid more is used to check the tension and a shear wrench is used for snug tightening. But today, we're going to use automatic tension tester which provides more accurate result by computer. This is shear wrench. As you can see, there are two sockets. The outer socket engages the nuts and the inner socket engages the pin tail which is also called spline end. Um, if you pull the trigger The outer socket turns and tightens the nuts until the bolts achieve the required tension. And then the outer socket stops and the inner socket turns the pin tail until it is sheared off. Okay, let's do some tests with our samples. KPF produced TC bolts according to ASTM, JSS2, and EN as well. Today, we have prepared the samples according to JSS2 S10T tissues. The size is M20 by 70. Okay. Assemble the boards to the low cell. And assemble the washer. And assemble the nut. The marking size should be outside. Before full tightening, you need to snug tight. If you don't snug tight, the bolts and washer can be rotated and you cannot get the proper tension. Okay, let me do the snug tight. Now tight is has been done. Okay. Let's full tightening using this shear wrench until the pin tail shear off. The pin tail has been sheared off and it is in this socket. If you pull this trigger, the pin tail pops off. Okay, the minimum tension of this size is 17,500 kg force and the result is around 19,000 kg force. The, so the result is good. Okay, let's do some more tests. Test result is 20,000 kg first. 
Thank you. We done all the tests today. If you have any question, please visit our website or please contact our salesperson. Thank you.